previously on No Limits. We're down one, right? Naomi's knee is bothering her. So she's icing up and she's not gonna play this game. I know I have to get better at being on time to things, especially since I'm gonna be going to Arizona in the next few months. That's four 30-point wins in a row. So I think all the pieces are coming together, just hopefully Naomi gets back right because we kind of need her for the season. We're about to do some bands for your glutes. So when you're doing here, it's here, okay? Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know what it is about it. If the music plays and it just makes us dance. Oh, she's playing bangers these past two days. There she go. We never stopped dancing, singing. There was Linda from the uh -huh. <laughs> Heavy day, light day. We're just going to have fun. Let's get this dance. Let's go. Okay, so this is resistance. So you put it around your waist, okay? Then you're going you're gonna, to, well, these guys, the guys get out of the way. Yeah, okay. Me and Naomi have a strong relationship, so I hope these exercises get her knee better for tomorrow. What is it, Nay? What, what is it? What is it, your knee? Naomi went down with a knee injury, so seeing her cry was like, whoa, like, she's actually hurt. We all just went off, so she know we had her back. They be playing games, but they be hurting for real. They think it's funny. Her and Brea be doing that snap the band thing. It makes me so mad, but they laugh so hard. You know, we're just having fun, so I just felt like slapping her with the band. Okay, so when we get in there, I'm gonna I'm gonna set it up what we're doing. Okay, we need to be focused. We can laugh, we can dance in between sets, but let's not have any more slippage today where we, where we get injured, okay? I like weights, I know they're necessary to keep our body right throughout the season. In preseason, we do a lot more weights than we do in season. You know, I'm trying to get big. We're trying to get Aki and big this season. Time for you to bulk up a little bit. <laughs> TVM as a coach, you can tell she has a lot of fun with us. We have a good bond with her. Freya, why don't you turn this way so you're not in her way? So that leg has to be in the air. <laughs> Coach definitely got down and dirty and showed us how it gets done. We talked about this right in the weight room. If we're gonna cheat on a rep, if we're gonna give up on a 20 second sit up, what are you gonna do when you're in the game? If you're gonna quit in here, you're gonna quit in there. I think TBM pushes us because she knows our potential. So I think her constantly pushing us is her way of showing that she cares. Everybody in the country knows that TBM is the best of the best. We all respect her and trust her. Every little detail, everything we do matters, all right? So let's make sure that we're pushing each other, we're holding each other accountable for that. Got it? Toys on three, one, two, three, toys. It's a championship game. We get to play on the big court this time. We found out Naomi can't play in this game, so that just makes us want to turn up even more. Desert Vista, they're a good team out of Arizona. They're bigger than us, they crash the board, so we just gotta make sure we follow the game plan, play fast, and score more points than they do. The first quarter we came out hot. We're following the game plan exactly, and we're just playing how we're supposed to. I was getting buckets, doing my thing. Brea is definitely our go-to. The more we play together, the more we just know we clicking here. It's clicking. But at the same time, Brea's gonna get tired. So we gotta figure out ways to play without her, and I think we're doing a really good job of that this year and just playing transition. So we all come together and just fill that void of Brea not being in the game. We're up 36 to 19 at halftime, but we know that this team is not to sleep on. What I'm most impressed with is our ability to watch a game scout and talk about a game scout 
and then actually execute the game scout. That was terrific. I really like how our guards are attacking, and then they're trying to stop you, and then you guys are just dropping dimes. We're taking good shots, we're attacking, but a couple threes, right? A couple turnover missed shots, and, and they're right back in the game again, and I, I saw it last night. This is a championship game, so we're not gonna let that happen. We're gonna fight them. We're gonna win the war on the boards. All right, let's go do it. Let's finish it. Let's finish it, okay? Woo! They have no answer for Brea, obviously. Nobody really does, so. During that third quarter, Des Vista did not come to play. Here he started going off, knocking down some shots. We gotta figure it out and make an adjustment. So Maya went down, so we was all like, everybody was wide-eyed, everybody was scared again, because we, if we got two of our starters out, we're kind of in trouble. We got one more quarter to go. We can't have another player out. It's kind of hard to keep it positive when your teammates get hurt, but I think we all just dive in more and got to play harder, got to play smarter. And one! We got to close out this game. No more silly turnovers, no more injuries. Just smooth sail. I was getting to my game, making buckets, just doing it. Congratulations to your 2022 Sweet 16 Girls Basketball Champion. We won the championship of our tournament. You know, it's a great feeling. Our first tournament win as a team. Ladies and gentlemen, Brea. Yeah. 2022 MVP. Brea won MVP of the game. None knew. We just got a big dub from a team from Arizona. It was a good challenge for us since, you know, next week we're going to TLC and we lost it yeah, last year, so we're definitely going back for revenge. Now we're 5-0. and We got to get ready to take this flight back to Arizona again this year to turn them into champions. We're headed back to Arizona just like we did last year, and we're doing Secret Santa. The coach got scared because when we had to go through security still and she was scared that I was going to get like deported for having a Nerf gun in my backpack or something. Brad got through security with her so we didn't have any problems but we had a lot of fun with the Nerf guns. Pizza Pringles. Here comes the Pizza Pringles, the best flavor of Pringles. Oh, oh the tropical one. <laughs> Just touched down in Arizona and we're about to head to the hotel. We gotta redeem ourselves from last year. Last year in Arizona, we lost the very first game. Time out, time out, time out. I got an injured player. Which was not supposed to happen. We were supposed to go all the way to the championship and win it. We fought hard, but it just wasn't enough. But this year, we gotta get it done. Yeah, the, the van music doesn't work either. We gotta check engine light, but we came prepared, right, Jada? The music in the van was broken, so we tried to have a speaker and stuff, but it just, the vibe was not it. So bad. <laughs> Me and Brea both have roots back to Arizona. She was born in Tucson. I started my elementary school days in Phoenix, so we're excited to get back there and start our new career. We're gonna graduate in six months and then we're gonna be living in Arizona, like for real. Damn, that's crazy. Bro, we're about to be in college soon. I mean, yeah, I mean, we're basically roommates right now. Every time we go to like a tournament, we're always in the same hotel room, so. Brea, my first impression of you was like, oh, see, you're weird. Cause you didn't talk. I'm not weird, it's just I don't talk to everybody. After you slapped me last year <laughs> in Arizona at this tournament and the in the escape room, I was like, oh, I think I like her. <laughs> and then we just getting cool, you know? But now, you my dog. You might be my roomie too. Slay King. Slay King. Enough of the chit chat, it's game time. Thank you for the towel. Hi guys. We're here. 
PBOC is just the best of the best high school teams that come out for this tournament. So this year, they're coming out one game at a time. We're trying to win the whole thing. Last year we played in the little high school. It was cool, but it wasn't nothing fancy. This year they bossed up. We had the new facilities, the new courts, new balls, more media was there. This TOC is a lot different from last year. We got college coaches out all around the gym, and it's just a great environment. We're 11 0 and they're 8 0, so somebody's going to get their first L of the season today. Air ball. I know it's Naomi's first game back from her injury, but dang. This is looking ugly. We had a bad start, but we know what's at stake. It's time to start hooping. TOC is one of our first big tournaments of the year, so you know I had to go crazy and give the college coaches a show. The end goal is just to get more offers this year. Going into the second half, we gotta keep Brad more. We got two more quarters and then we, we're advancing, okay? And I told you this team, I mean, they run their stuff, they're physical, like beat them on every little thing. Rebounding. Bray, you gotta box out harder when they're shooting free throws because she's just, she's like getting position on you, okay? So just keep, keep playing. We got people we can sub in, we got people we can sub in, okay? Let's just pick the zone apart and make it look stupid. And when we get a rebound, everybody needs to run hard. Everybody, okay? Let's finish strong, okay? All right. Come on, day one. Sorry. On the next, no limit. You make it or you don't make it, it's the same facial expression, okay? Brea couldn't be stopped. We got Sacred Heart national ranked game, number four against number 17, so I'm excited. They got a top ranked player, Zakiya Johnson, but we ready. Oh. Full indoor court with everything in their house. We are at the bowling alley celebrating Tajiana's 17th birthday. TBM said she wanted to talk, so let's see what she got to say. Megan, what you got on? I mean, besides this video on my laptop, I'm rocking the Star Play collection. Sheesh, that's a banger. Where'd you get that? The Overtime Shop, duh! Just click right here and get fed like me.